You never know who gonna pop. Mm-hmm. You never know who gonna be that next nigga. That's, that's fat. I yeah. just know I want them on my song. That's what a W feel like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love rap to death, but sometimes I can't I can't listen to rap all day. I gotta switch that shit up. What it is, pop your shit. If you ain't popping your shit, I don't know what you're doing. You better pop your shit. If you ain't popping so, shit, you yeah. popping pussy, girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> cheated on my ex, but I regret telling her I cheated. You know what I'm saying? Of course the relationship went to shit. Baby, that's an ass whooping whooping. Told him stay humble, man. We told him stay humble. Fuck all that humble shit. Fuck ah, <laughs> that shit, man. Fuck yeah. that shit, man. Hey! Oh, y'all want me to show? It's, it's on yeah. Dizzy, for real. It's over. Okay, let's get it. Bop, 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 bop. Oh, my God. That scared the shit out of me. Hey, what's happening, man? It's me, Flo, a.k.a. Way, a.k.a. Count. I'm here right now with my partner, Bobby Critical. What's good? What's good? And right now, we playing Spades. Yeah. About to get that ass whooped, too. So, yeah. About to get it whooped. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Y'all know what y'all doing today? Me and y'all trap. Look like we at the crib. Let, let them know what those Okay. Yeah. Oh, these are black cards. Okay. These are black cards. This is real serious. I'm going to pass these out to you, man. Okay, cool. This is real serious, man. You do anything wrong, like Renee, uh, try to talk across the table with your with your homie, anything yeah. like that, man, it's going to get took. All right? It's okay. going to get took. So what's the purpose of it? If you get that took, you're no longer black no more. Okay. It's over. Black card revoke. Revolt. Yeah, your skin revoke. Yeah, you might well go to the other side. Let's go. Yeah, I know. So. And we playing ace, huh? Yeah. Y'all know how to play that? I we ain't played it in a minute, but we gonna, we gonna. Man, we all right, bro. We, we, we do deuce, it. joke, joke, you know what I'm saying? No talk oh. across the board, no reneging. No eye contact. Don't be trying to throw it. Don't be That's trying crazy. to do all this. <laughs> That's eye crazy, contact. Don't be trying to do all this. Do eye contact, <laughs> man. Well, you got to so we good. Anyway, he ain't going to Right. He ain't gonna understand anyway. And we playing the best out of three games. Uh-huh. Is the winner. Yeah. So Desi, we playing for Desi. It's a free feature, beat by Bobby Crew. Yeah. And K. Yeah. So you gotta create me a song. So we win. Me. If you win, I gotta invest in my business. There you go. And you, we got yeah. we need a free stand. I gotta be in one of your. Yeah, yeah, I need a free stand. I gotta be in one of your videos. I gotta do some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we okay. do it like that. We do it like that. Okay, free stand up. Yeah, we need a free stand up. If we win, you gotta create me a whole song. I'm talking about. I want a fun song. I'm talking about a lady song, dance song. You know what I'm saying? Okay, we got you. We got you. Shane on. Y'all got that? Y'all got that? Yeah, yeah. Get this on camera. Yeah, on camera. Hey, KK, what's on your playlist, bro? Right now. You gotta know, cause you making too much club music. I got uh, Vez on now. I got some future on there. I got some. Um, to be honest with you, I just, I just, I try to find motivation everywhere. You want to move, listeners? Like you know, yeah, you're in the mood. You know what I'm like, oh, I gotta play this style. I love, I love rap to death, but sometimes I can't, I can't listen to rap all day. What city running music right now? Yeah, I had to jump in on that. I think we Atlanta running. I'm about to say we gonna. I mean, always, I ain't want to be. We bad. gonna stay ten toes on that. No. Yo, Memphis, Memphis coming. Memphis no, for hard. Sure. Oh yeah, Memphis up through there for sure. No, Memphis, for sure. uh, who uh, shit, uh, Detroit. Detroit. Detroit, 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 mm-hmm. yeah. Detroit niggas, Memphis, man. Detroit, Atlanta. Who shuffle? I want to take it back to the beginning, man. Okay. You know, who was your inspiration as a kid? Like, what made you want to do it as a kid? Like, did you see like the Michael Jacksons, the Prince? The Michael Jackson, the Pops, the Biggest. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, all the all the Atlanta legends. You know what I'm saying? The underground niggas that folks really don't know about. Yeah. Bone Thugs. You know what I'm saying? All oh, that yeah, good yeah, shit, yeah, dog. Yeah. Everybody who just. Who had some waves? Anybody who popped up on my TV when I was a young nigga in the living room, mm-hmm. that's who motivated me. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's hard. That's hard. What about you, man? You know, me was Eddie Murphy, Martin Lawrence. Eddie Murphy, that's hard. They were my guys. That's you know, hard. Growing up as a kid, I, I, yeah, I used to sit in front of the TV, especially watching Mark. Let's talk about a new generation though, like the TikTok. You know how songs go viral now. Do you feel like it's needed? Like you know, that's that's a big part of the culture. What's going on right now? I think that's just what's making the industry money right now. Hmm. It's the trend right now. You it's know, trends you. always change on you. It's on me. You know, we're going to see. I really wanted to change. Ah, it's all good, baby. Let me find oh, out. It's all good, huh? Let me I know find what's going out. on. And how is it, you know, being in the rap game? You know what I'm saying? Like, how how, how much should you stay, you know, humble? How Damn. much should you have confidence? What's you up, know? bro? Ain't shit. We playing. You we, we playing space, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you feeling some type of way? Eighty hand is. I, I, I ain't tell buddy the guy. So you interviewing and he just getting the book. I, I mean, I'm just having. Yeah, he's throwing us out. They really, they really fucking with us, right? But now. I'm still, I'm questions. still focused. He's though. striking. I'm yeah, still right, focused. Okay. I'm still focused. But all right, that's you, my bad. You, go, ahead, you, go, ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. You said humble. You know, um, you've been a rap artist in the game. How often do you have to be humble? But how often do you have to have confident at the same time when it comes to this? You know, because they want you to be nice. They want you to, yeah, yeah. You know, respect the game and all that. But you know, how do you feel about that? I feel like it's fifty-fifty. I feel like I was humble way too long. 
You know what I'm saying? Till I had to just pop my shit a little bit. You know what I'm saying? That humble shit only get you so far. They take advantage when you're too humble. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes you got to just stand on your 10 and just show them that you, who you is. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Just because we all work hard for this shit. You know what I'm saying? We all go home and believe in what the fuck we doing. Mm. Yeah. Y'all nigga going crazy right now. Fuck don't all these about, questions. Don't, <laughs> he got the hand, bro. Hey, don't worry about what we doing. Fuck all these questions, Don't man. worry about what we doing. But look, going to keep God doing. Damn. So, hey, you know what I want to ask you, though, from your perspective? Real okay. shit. Cause I know you. I know you for a long, yeah, for sure. long time. For like sure. Mariachi. Mariachi day, right? Look, Ooh, hey. what would you tell people, like, what's the difference between being independent mm -hmm. and being, what, like, a major? You think, would you want to be major early or independent early? How would you? I feel like I started independent. I would have made the sign me, but you know we all know it's a it's, it's a bag thing. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? We know we know we come with a bag. I've been independent for almost a year. Like mm -hmm. as far as like knowing the game, actually knowing what's going on independently. That shit it, it's it's a motherfucker, but it got to be done. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel like independently, you get something to strike, you're gonna be set up. Your bank account gonna look pretty pretty healthy. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So. It's about just making the right strategic moves, having the right partners, having the right network. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Just really just, you got to get out there. You can't be, you can't say you're independent, be in the house all day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I feel like nah, that comes with trial and error, though. Big yeah, trial, trial and error. You got to get outside. I be outside. No, you know what I'm saying? I be traveling. I go everywhere, wherever where I, wherever I feel like the bag at, I'm going to go. Mm -hmm. Even if I don't want to go, I'm mm -hmm. going to go because I know that's where the money is and I might meet the, the motherfucker to change my life mm -hmm. or change my whole, you know what I'm saying, my whole labor, my whole, you know what I'm saying, everybody who around me. So it's like, I don't know. Y'all whooping our ass, though. I don't like this they, shit. They whooping shit, right? God right. damn. Y'all got this Slide friend. it over here, partner. Y'all got you, dog? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's 10 books. I got you. Yeah. And, and, and it's so crazy. That's 11 books. That's yeah. embarrassing. I ain't yeah. had no, no face card. I don't get I remember, like, the first time I met you, we was at the gym. Yeah. We, uh, we, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and one thing I can say, shout bro. Shout out to Ted, man. Yeah, shout out to Ted. You, you been the same person that you was. For sure. You know, when I first met you. For sure. You, know you too, though. Yeah. I salute that. You, you, been, you know, you been grinding. You know, you've been doing your thing, but how, but how do you stay yourself? How do you stay the same going through all this when it comes to the industry and you you feeling like you you not where you you know you're supposed they to counted, be? They counted K Camp out. Hey, how do you? They not, did. I'm gonna I'm tell you. Back I, back I, I know they counted them out. They definitely did. I know they yeah. did for a fact. Mm. How about to say they better ride? <laughs> <laughs> no, for they better sure. slide. How I stay myself, bro? Yeah. I stay in my lane, bro. I don't. I don't I fuck with niggas, but I make sure, you know what I'm saying, my energy and my bubble gonna stay yeah, yeah, yeah. real secluded. You know what mm. I'm saying? I gotta protect my energy at all costs. Uh, you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah y'all will. Y'all ain't even gotta count. You got 10, you got 10, you got 10. You ain't gotta count. 10. 10. <laughs> 10 get you in. Like ass whooping. Can you say? Can ass whooping. Shove that bitch. I'm gonna slow it down for the people that's watching. Say, ass whooping. There you go. They went crazy. You said it with me. Man, what's that? Type it, type it on that. Yes. Ass They went crazy. Yes. It went crazy. I'm, I'm, I, I see the little, you know what I'm saying, the, the mix they got going. It's a little distraction. Yeah, Play yeah. your card, ask a question. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. No, for sure. But um, what, did I answer the question? Yeah, you, yeah, you, know, you did. I, okay, I, okay, I got okay, another okay, question okay, for okay, you. Okay. Um, for the young artists out there, can blowing up too fast, like, hurt them? Yeah, for sure. I just feel like, you know what I'm saying, we ain't got no foundation. We done seen it a thousand times. I ain't going to name no niggas, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying, if you, ain't, if you ain't built no foundation under you, you go, you go to the moon too quick. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? When you ain't got that song or you ain't hot no more, where you gonna go? Mm -hmm. You gonna blow your bag because mm -hmm. ain't nobody teaching you how to spend your money. Mm -hmm. ain't, no, ain't nobody teaching you how to, how to manage your money. Mm -hmm. So you gonna run through your bag. Yeah, I feel like I feel like financial literacy need to come in place at some point. You know what I'm saying? Especially when you put your team together. You gotta have somebody that, that give you the knowledge, you know what I'm saying, of how to handle your money early on. Mm -hmm. that and way you mental, though. Be fucked. Yeah. Mm -hmm. with, with that being said, uh, to add to what you say, who in the game should be bigger that you think right now that that K can be like, hey, he need more credit. Like he's he's stamped. And to answer your question, some people just gotta be willing to open up and take that advice and they gotta put a value on that because you shouldn't want to get that for free. Nah, you for sure. So I think that'll be fine. But to answer your who question. I feel like should be bigger. Me. Big fan. I, I nah, for <laughs> sure. talk that shit. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. But but the thing is What you think it is though? I don't dick right. Um, and I don't play the I don't play by the rules these nigga play. Mm. I do my own shit and, I, and I, I I lead by my you know what I'm saying I lead from the heart. I do my shit. Facts. You know what I'm saying. And everybody got their own agenda they want you to play by. But mm. I wasn't raised like that. Facts. But at the same time, I think I, I look at it like this. I always ask myself every day about the same the same question y'all niggas ask. I ask myself. So I ain't really I ain't really you know what I'm saying in denial of the shit. Mm. It's just like I look at this it, guy timing. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying like. You got you got you got to understand what you measure success by. 
I just did two tours this year, sold out 95%. Ooh. I did 45 shows Say straight. Again. You know what I'm saying? I just went on a sprint. Uh, on yeah, that. Pretty Ones Tour and a Spin a Block Tour. You know. You, you pull up, go to my Instagram, pull up. When I say this shit, pull Ooh. up my Instagram, show them. So the crap, you know what I'm saying? Do all that. Ooh, yes, you know what I'm saying? So it's like. That's hard. You you, you got to just. What's, what's success to a nigga, though? That's, that's, the, that's, that's, that's the question. You feel me? You got to understand yeah. that. You got to know what success is, and when you're successful, mm -hmm. then you got to succeed in success mm. to become even more successful. Yeah. Because I ain't going to lie, I battle that, too, sometimes yeah. with myself. We all do, because yeah. it's our first time winning. Yeah, for mm -hmm. sure. You got to think. No, you not mm. realize this is your first bar. time winning, bro. That's a bar right there. Stop acting like this shit's supposed to be bigger and better. No, nigga, that's your first. That's what a W feel like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Now you know how to make the W better, because you see how you can celebrate different. Yeah. So you see right. how hard you could go. Mm -hmm. So that's really what it is. Yeah. Real talk, I think that's what it is. And I think when you level up, you gotta know how to level up your team. You gotta mm -hmm. realize that these are people you grew up with. It's impossible for them to take you to the next level. And they gotta be humble enough to know that they're not losing a the spot. They learn a profession Facts. from a professional. Mm -hmm. Facts. Facts. And, that's and two, we all learning at the same yeah, time. But that's too. two things we learning at the same time, maintaining and keeping a profession. So you ain't gonna be focused on them too until you're done. Mm -hmm. Or failed. Yeah. Big fat. Yeah. Or made it, you know yeah. what I'm saying? This, like, shit, this shit all a journey, man. Like, this shit just... I'd be lying if I say this shit easy. Mm -hmm. This but shit ain't shit easy. definitely ain't. This shit is not easy. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you built for it, you built for it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I ain't gonna count, though, this shit. That's why the reward be bro, so I ain't even trying to go against you, bro, but this shit easy. <laughs> this shit easy. I swear, bro, you gotta stay in your lane. I heard, yeah, you, yeah. I heard you say niggas ain't fucking with you. I guarantee you, bro. You got Nobody told us this, K, right? See, and Bobby, like, and Desi. Like, nobody told us that we got to start amount of money and work that money. But people like us, we just dug in our pocket and like, fuck it, we got to get famous. Mm -hmm. When in reality, at, from a business one-on-one, that's terrible business skills because you ain't need to do a SWOT analysis on yourself. You ain't scope out the, the work that you about to get into. Mm -hmm. You ain't check the demographics. You ain't Facts. do shit. So Facts. you went into it blindfolded. Facts. But I say now being like Waka, Desi, K, uh, Bobby, we got to get to a point to where we can say, yo, can I spend 25000 or 30000 a month on myself? And it, it all reverts back to you. When the bigger you get, the more you got to learn how to do. Mm -hmm. And people ain't going to do for a nigga that's already on. Facts. they can't get a lot out of it. Facts. Mm -hmm. Facts. And sometimes we just got to respect that shit and the truth hurt. But yeah, no, that, that's, that's some real shit, though. That's some real shit. Because I, 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 like you said, you know what I'm saying, it's easy, but it's just when you learn it, when you got to learn it for yourself, that's the hard part. When you got to figure this shit out. Because you, you said some shit like... A lot of people don't know business. A lot of people ain't got the business mindset to really like tap in. You don't know business until you're in it. Exactly. Yeah, then, yeah. Then, I learned a lot but just by being then in it. Then in yeah. business, mm -hmm. you got to learn me. being mm -hmm. ahead of a house. So a lot of stuff. information you can't bring to people until you figure it until out you, because you can you look understand. weak in the process mm -hmm. of finding your answer. That's a fact. That's so a fact. then you stuck with the with the flaw of trying to keep that shit real or bottom line and get, get to the business. That's a fact. How you feel about the future of rapping, man, with the XXL? Do you feel like that's still, like, relevant? Do you feel like that matter now? Like, with, with the freshmen of the, of hip-hop? Oh, the XXL and shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How you feel about that? I still like it's, it, it. It still matter. At, at the end of the day, it's the artists who got to prove they sell. You mm -hmm. can get thrown in that cover all day, but if you ain't Produce standing it. on and, and giving the product out, shit. There's a lot of niggas that be on them covers that burnt out. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Who, I want to help. Shout out to XXL. That shit did, you know what I'm saying, did a number for my career. You know what I'm gonna say to some Georgia boys in here, man? Yeah, I feel like this, right? This is no slack to our city. But I feel like when they come to like Atlanta, the, the city get more love than the state. And Atlanta only won because the state was winning in music. For yeah. instance, if South Georgia got more love, West got more love, East got more love, and North got more love, and South, not just the city, mm -hmm. Georgia will run more music. Because in Georgia, we had a lot of soulful shit. Yeah, like a lot of soulful artists. Like I, we lost our soulful artists because everybody want to be, want to be trendy. Y'all gotta think about that. Yeah, like we gotta open up Georgia more. That motherfucker might slide. It ain't. They gonna slide. Oh yeah, <laughs> regardless. Oh yeah. Oh <laughs> yeah. Talk to me. Yeah. Told him stay humble. Hey. Told that him bitch. stay humble, man. We told him stay humble. Championship. Humble. His heart staying humble, man. It is. And, and I just talked about home. Yeah, we just talked about home. Fuck all that humble shit. Fuck that shit, man. Fuck that shit, man. Hey. Oh, y'all want me to show? It's your show? It's, it's on his. It's on me? OK, let's get it. Hey, I ain't going to lie. I put that on me because I did something.
I did something. Yeah. The real deal championship, yeah. man. Yeah. And also, before we get into the championship, man, this part of the show is called Renee. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. And what's a moment in your life you got caught up doing something you should? <laughs> what you mean, though? It seems like you got a lot of them, too. <laughs> I was like, like, what you mean? Like, <laughs> like getting caught like, up doing like, something I shouldn't. You got to give him a topic. Yeah, like, you got caught up shit. doing some um, shit. Man. Regret. It ain't nothing that you regret. Um, I'm going to keep it all the way, P. You know what I'm saying? Cheated on my ex, but I told her I cheated. But I regret telling her I cheated. You know what I'm saying? Like, I told her I did it. But that, you know what I'm saying? Of course, the relationship went to shit. I feel like, damn, like that was a, that was a good one. You know what I'm saying? I fuck, you know what I'm saying? I fucked up a good one. So, you know, I, I put that right there. One of the so K Cam do got regret. Yeah, so so women really don't want the truth when they say, "Can you tell me the truth?" They don't want the I truth. I thought she did, cause she was like, "Just tell me." I ain't gonna. And leave. I told her, and she did, and she said it was over. With. Mm-hmm. Wow. Well, actually, it, I ain't gonna say it was over. With. She was fucked up about it, and she tried to get back, and it just, you know, you know when that vibe gone. You know what I'm saying? At, at that point, you forcing some shit. Mm. Like everything just don't feel like the same shit. So I just like, man, we might as well just end this shit. Mm. Like, are you like in a relationship? Are you married? Or are you, you know, who? You? I'm single. Single. Why yeah. you feel like you single? Cause one, I feel like these females can't handle me. Okay. Two. Um. Generation we in right now, this shit fucked up. I don't know. I'm, I'm scared of goddamn. I've been catfish so much, bro. What? I just got catfish last night. I got. Catfish. Oh, let's talk about it. I want to know what. <laughs> I like that. What, what, what was it? What, how, what, 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 where you met her at? The I ground, of course. The ground. Yeah, 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 you know oh, what I'm saying? Was... You, know, you know, you meet somebody on the ground, boom, boom. They pull up on you like, oh. Was it the fence page? It wasn't out of shape. Or was it, it was a real page? It was a regular page. Okay, but okay. it was just like, you know the ground boot girls up. You Man, know, a little boot up page. They got the craziest filters. Yeah, though. you know what I'm saying? You see them, you be like, nah, you got to deal with the, with the, with the reality. Mm. And then be like, okay, you, you got this going on. Did you still handle the business? Did you? Nah, I'm I just told her to come too. eat, and we did. I dipped off. I said, I'm about to eat and go home. <laughs> told her straight up. Like, I'm about to- <laughs> she probably like, why you doing that? I'm dead ass serious. Like, I'm I, in this climate. Nah, I just injured, bro, I really don't know how to do shit like that. Like, you how did. do you do that? Man, shit. You want to know how I date? Yeah, you'll go out and eat. Like, with, like yeah. Go get some food, go get some drinks, you know what I'm saying? Go to the strip club, vibe out, or go out of town. Yeah. They yeah. got to be somebody I really, you know, I ain't going to say I really fuck with, but yeah, I got to just, either I want to hit that shit. No, I'm just being completely honest. I want to hit that shit or I just see potential in you. But we still going. I ain't gonna lie, me personally. I've been locked in. I ain't even be thinking about that shit for real. And that and that's the vibe I'm on though. I don't, I don't need, I'm I'm about to cut everything off. Hey, I ain't gonna lie though, okay? I gotta tell you this, bro. You overthinking your craft. Overthinking what you mean? Look what I said. You overthinking it. Everything. Like you hold you my too brother, much I feel music. Like you hold I way agree. too much music. You overthink it. You thinking You talking about releasing shit? No, bro, you play God too much in your life. Mm. Cause you thinking like what you think people think, and that's only God know that. Mm. I think. So let I, me ask you, what should I do? I think you, it's time for you to be vulnerable. It's time for I you to do be shit. vulnerable. Nah, it's time for you to do shit that you uncomfortable with. That and not, we ain't talking about manhood shit, uh, going against your <laughs> yeah, respect yeah, yeah. and things like that. I ain't trying to be some nobody. But I think vulnerable meaning go places that you ain't normally going. Don't go with a lot of people. Bro, I ain't even gonna cap, bro. I always see when you go out, you never come to the party. You come bring your vibe. Mm-hmm. Well, really, you supposed to go to that party vibe and turn into your vibe. Mm-hmm. I think I think that's the part a lot of artists miss. They miss that they keep trying to bring their vibe to a party that they never been to. When they should go into the party and show the party why they vibe should be here. And that's the, that's what you need to do, yo. Now it's some real shit though. Hey, yeah, because you can turn. Shit. I like that. You can turn the vibe. It's like Travis Porter. Music. You is. It's exactly. like Walker Flock. It's we got like the same vibe of music. Like you can just play it and it, it turns apart. The party could be playing switches in this bitch and got drunk. He go, whoa, oh, oh, bitch be like, oh yeah. Yeah, like, exactly. Uh, hey, yeah, yeah. It's different. Yeah. So you gotta stick to that. You gotta, bro, you you gotta, gotta stick st- to this game too. <clears throat> yeah, it ain't my go. That's some real shit though. I love I love hearing, you know what I'm saying? A lot of folks don't like criticism. I love hearing shit that like I right, I take it, uh, I doubt. You got to look, you got everything that's that's needed to to, to be that that guy. You still young, you still yeah. fresh, you still popping your shit. For sure. He got sure. he just got relaxed his forehead. I feel like <laughs> it's like an expression like he's just like this all day trying to figure it out. Yeah. And it's figured out, bro. Mm. Like like I was telling you, bro, that small big theory, you gotta live with it. Yeah. Cause then you know all your gifts. Yeah. You start peeping them motherfuckers out like shit, I got hot water, bro. Yeah. I could buy some new forces. Yeah. But I really could go buy goddamn wings and fill in wings every day if I went to, but I ain't finna got to settle for the dollar menu. Yeah. It's just simple gifts, bro. We got to just start rocking out with them. So we going to politic. 
I, need, I seen you, know you with somebody protecting your life, uh, bro. That, oh, yeah, my fault. That's a gift. A lot of niggas don't even want to risk their life helping nobody. Like, it's a lot of gifts. Yeah. Hey, question. You think as a, as an artist, when you see stuff like like things happening in the community, you think as an artist, you got to be like, fuck that, I'm finna go stand up. Because a lot of people put pressure on us. When they ask questions, like for scientists, and when they ask science questions, they feel like rappers got to all, or entertainers got to goddamn gotta say, say something, something about scientists. And we ain't even no fucking scientists. I think it be, you know what I'm saying, you got to go with your gut. You feel like you want to say something about something, then you say something. But I think, bro, we need to start focusing on who fire and black. That's a scientist. You hmm. know what I mean? I think all of us, we should figure that out. We know how to figure out who got a fat ass. <laughs> right. That's a fact. Y'all won, though. We need, start, won. we need to start finding out who do illustration for books. Like It might sound <laughs> like until you got kids. Until right. you see your kids reading some different shit, you're going to be like, damn, shit, I, I need to try to start this now. I know that in our community, we always want to start shit that our kids, we don't like our kids doing. Yeah. That was good. That was good. I mean, y'all won though, so I'm just saying, but that was still good. That was a good hand. We kicked shit at that point. That was that was pretty goddamn good right there. Yeah, that was all I had too. That was good. Also, this is the part of the game we call put your bid in. Okay, bet. Future hip hop. Mm. Who's the future? Rahway. Mm. Oh yeah, on the low for sure. Mm. My boy don't. My boy don't pop out. My boy don't be in no shit. My boy be ducked off. Mm. Getting number one. Getting number Every one year. album. Mm. So let me ask y'all. So. You know what I'm saying? Niggas feel like when you're in the game, like you gotta be, you know what I'm saying? You gotta be extra to get noticed. But you see a nigga come through like right away, mm -hmm. not doing doing the total opposite still. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? How y'all feel about that? What y'all, what you feel like the approach you should take? In my opinion, I feel like people are complaining. Because when I know I started, I never complained, ever. Yeah. I went to every open mic in Georgia on mm, God. That's hard. I went to every promoter that threw a college party. I went for free if they gave me two hundred dollars, three hundred dollars a bottle, a blue motherfucker. That's hard. I, I went to five hundred dollar shows. I started doing two hundred dollar shows. Mm -hmm. Like it's a different. I, I ain't think about going to patchwork or studio time. I bought a two hundred dollar mic from Walmart. We had a PC computer, a hanger, and put a stocking in it over the for a filter. Go. And use hell of reverb and had too much fun doing Filter, all that shit. Yeah, yeah. Because bro, we I I knew I start watching everybody around. I'm like, damn, why everybody want to look rich? Mm. One thing my uncle Joe told me. I I, I told him this before. He's like, I don't even remember telling you. I'm like, yeah, you just crazy. <laughs> he told me one day I was rapping. He said, Yo, Walker, stop trying to look rich, nigga. He said, rich niggas are rich. We know you ain't rich, nigga. You trying to look rich. You mm. look dumb. Mm. So when he said that, it let me know, like, damn, why the fuck I'm trying to, back then, everybody want to put on, like, uh, Maury shoes and this. Mm -hmm. I'm like, bro, I'm finna be, bro, I'm finna put my white tees on, bro. Yeah. Fuck this. My Levi's and Cortez. Like, yeah. And you can relate to people that like you. Work, yeah. Man, that, that shit work, yeah. That shit work for you. These people, they don't want to be relatable. They act like they ain't never struggled. Like, I've been on all my life. And you could be around niggas that love you and be like, I don't trust a soul. Niggas don't got my back. I don't, I don't like talking like that. I'm yeah. like, bro, what the fuck you like talking like that around me? I'm your brother. Mm. So I never was that kind of person, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. More of the story, know yourself. Know yeah, yourself. you got to, man. Know yourself. Know yourself, man. Oh, Do you, are there people out there in the industry that you mentor? Yeah. You know it's so crazy with me? That's, I had, that's I had, about default. Yeah, for sure. It, it was one thing, like, I, I came in the game trying to reach out to the, to the niggas that was above me, you know what I'm saying? Like the you know, some niggas that came out, the niggas that was popping. And it felt like I was chasing too much. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get in contact with niggas and fuck with niggas. Like, oh, fuck with me, get on this song type mm -hmm. shit. Like you said earlier, knowing who you is and standing on, I was like, man, I'm about to reverse the shit mm -hmm. and be, you know what I'm saying, inspire the youth mm -hmm. and, and, and tap in with the, with, the, with the young niggas coming up. You never know who gonna pop. Mm -hmm. You mm -hmm. never know who gonna be that next nigga. That's, that's fact. I yeah. just know I want them on my song. Right. Hey, you heard that song, niggas in New York re recreated your shit? What one? Oh, let's do it. It's like some drill shit, ain't yeah, it? Yeah, that, that shit kinda song? hard too. Hey, I fuck with them. It's hard. Mm -hmm. That shit hard. But them niggas like took every word. Am I tripping? <laughs> <laughs> That's flattering. Shit, oh, God, I, I, I ain't tripping. <laughs> the fact that they inspired in 2023 Smack. and it came out hmm. 2009. Shit, no matter, February. I was gonna do it, go do it anyway. Mm. Y'all know it. Damn, he threw that ace off. Ooh, that fast. Might as well. Play Say. Play that twin. Damn. Damn. Lord, he yeah. Yeah, a you're a cook. Might tell well. He's cooked really bad. Out. You brought him? Exhausted. You was out with your resources. I ain't run out of nothing. Oh my God. I knew it. You gonna start running your mouth. All right, man. I knew it. Hey, partner, i go ahead then, boy. I knew it. All right, all right, all right, all right. That's three in a row, baby. That's an ass whooping whooping. Mm. You ever got an ass whooping whooping? Yeah. What was one of the worst whoopings you yeah. got as a child? Besides, you look strong, <laughs> though. How you, you know what I mean? I ain't had a good hand yet. 
nah, I know it. It's okay. It's all you know, that's what happened when you come in our house and you know, think you can do what you gotta do. <laughs> if y'all playing a real nigga way, well, you know what I'm saying? Shit would've went a little different. What you mean? <laughs> You already know what it Deuce is. Ah, oh, joke, 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 We playing. We try to keep it simple, man. We keep it simple. You know what I'm saying? We could have played away. We could have, but you know, we don't want to You want to run one joke, 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 do? Come on. Nah, we ain't being nice. Yeah, we didn't know we wasn't doing that. Okay, cool. All right, cool. You knew better, you do better. You know what I'm saying? That's right, man. But no, man, we appreciate y'all pulling up on this, man. We appreciate y'all, man. spanked. All right? I don't like that. It ain't what you like, man. Diaper boys. I don't like that. Anybody with you But before you go. Before you go, the, did you uh, put us in to the camera, man? What's one thing that you can get to some youngsters that's that's trying to become you, that's trying to become big in the you know in the industry, man? Some inspiration that's out there, man. Inspiration for the young niggas. Uh, do you? You know what I'm saying? Don't let everybody tell you what you need to do. You know what I'm saying? Follow your heart. You know what I'm saying? Of course, take advice. You know what I'm saying? But do what your gut tell you, because I know a lot of niggas told me to do certain shit that did not work, and I stayed to myself. I stayed true to myself, and that shit worked out. Uh, get you a good lawyer. Mm -hmm. Of course, uh, save that money and pop your shit. Pop your shit. You know what I'm saying? Do fly shit. You know what I'm saying? They whole love that fly shit. You know what I'm saying? Talk that good shit. You know what I'm saying? Don't be talking that corny ass shit. <laughs> All that lame. You know what I'm saying? Don't. You know what I'm saying? Just, just pop your shit, pop, brother. Pop it, pop it, pop it, pop it. Pop your shit. For sure. What it is? Pop your shit. If you ain't popping your shit, I don't know what you're doing. You better pop your shit. Like we just pop that ass in space. You ain't popping so, shit. You yeah. popping pussy, girl. <laughs> 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 So yes, man, another great episode of We Playing Spades, man. Give it up for my dog, Kate Camp in the building. I'm Larry Larry Banks. I'm Waka Flocka fucking playing. Yes, Let's sir. Go, man. Some real ones, some real ones. And we just spanked the ass, man. And make sure you tune in to the next episode of We Playing Spades. It is it. Fuck all that. We're going to see. We're going to be the next one. Stay tuned.